A lot of people don't know that there's a river when you ask, you know, when I was asked to be on the board, I was like, what, what's the river? <laughs> what river? So <laughs> that's okay, there it's it natural. Is. This is it, <laughs> this is part of it right here. It's 51 miles long. We're gonna help you find it. I'm Daphne Zuniga. We're here by the LA River, and I'm here with... Omar Brownson, and I'm the executive director of the LA River Revitalization Corporation. We have a river. We have a river. <laughs> We're gonna go see it. Follow. I think one of the great opportunities with the LA River is how we bring people and place together. And so just right here behind us, we have some young girls playing softball. We have equestrians riding their horses. We have a dog walker. We have a dog walker. <laughs> Show over there. Show over there. <laughs> it's a great place. <laughs> and that's, you know, at its best, place brings people together. And so I think, you know, that's one, for me, the exciting piece of the LA River is that how do we bring Los Angeles together, this big sprawling megalopolis and this river that's 51 miles is the one thing that can really connect us all. So most people know the LA River as the box channel in the valley or the trapezoidal where it's basically all concrete. And this particular section, which runs about eight miles, is one of maybe three spots along the river which has what we call a natural bottom. And the reason why it's a natural bottom is that the Army Corps couldn't pour enough concrete because the water table was too high, and so nature had a chance to thrive. Uh, and so what you see here is naturally occurring. And this is why we can have over 200 bird species in the river. This is why there's fishes in the river. Mm -hmm. uh, and this is why I have hope. Uh, that this can be a, a great public destination worthy of our city. Tell us, Omar, what this is we're looking at. So right here would be the first major philanthropic investment in the LA River, a bicycle, pedestrian, and equestrian bridge. The money for the bridge was donated, right? And it'll be going right here? Right across here. It's really an iconic destination, recognizing mm -hmm. that the LA River isn't just something that we cross, but it is something that we want to go to. I think it's so incredible to have nature, to have water and ducks and, you know, these incredible bushes and trees. I've seen turtles in there in the middle of Los Angeles. It's 51 miles long. There's every neighborhood is not that far from the LA River, you know, and to have a place to just get that peace that so you don't have to take a day trip even to the local mountains. It's, it's here. It's in your day. You can have it in your day. This was about a year or so ago. I was, she was taking, how old? My daughter was probably about four years old then and we were gonna go to ride the ponies in Griffith Park. And my daughter is a daughter's daughter. She loves pink princesses and anything, you know, to do with fairies. And so to ride horses was a, a special day. And we were driving over and she sees the LA River and she says, Dad, I wanna go to the river. And I said, not ride ponies. And she said, no. And so we spent the next three hours walking along here, dipping our toes in the water and it was then, you know, time to go home. And she didn't say, oh, daddy, let me go ride ponies now. It was like, no, this was a special moment. You know, and that this is something that she realizes that the LA she grows up in is gonna have a river. <laughs>